the Terminator actor Earl Bone has died at the age of 81. It has been reported that the star died on Thursday in Hawaii. The cause of death has not been revealed. A family member confirmed the news to TMZ. He was diagnosed with lung cancer last year, according to a friend of Bones and his family. The actor is survived by his second wife Kathy, his daughter Ruby, and his grandchildren Kimi Abarisha and Kimo Harbin. His first wife Carol Keane died in 2001 from ovarian cancer at the age of 58. Earl appeared as criminal psychologist Drive. Peter Silberman in 1984's The Terminator, 1991's Terminator 2, Judgment Day, and 2003's Terminator, Dark Fate. He also appeared as archive footage in Terminator, Dark Fate. Besides Arnold Schwarzenegger, he is the only actor to appear in each of the first three movies. Along with the Terminator movies, he had roles in Battle Beyond the Stars, The Man with Two Brains and Alien Nation. He had roles in Nutty Professor 2, The Clumps, The West Wing, The Prince and in The Golden Girls. Earl commonly took on doctor roles in television and movies and is noted for his role as Jim Peterson in Who's the Boss? The late star also had a recurring role as Dr. Kramer in the Fox series Get a Life. Alongside Tom Jones, he showed up in an episode of The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air in 1993. He retired from screen acting in 2003 but went on to do voice acting. Earl's voice acting credits include Mr. Bleakman in Clifford the Big Red Dog. Police Chief Konifke in Bonkers and the narrator in World of Warcraft. He was saying your senior, senior in Kim Possible, and Captain LeChuck in the Monkey Island series. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook.